Lastly, we find the equation for impedance z equal to under root r e square plus within bracket x l minus x e whole e square. So today, we, our topic is to find what is phase constant. As I have as I have already defined in the last lesson that phase angle is the angle between the current and the v in phase diagram for series LCR. Okay. So today's uh, let us uh, define what is how to find how to uh, get this phase constant. Okay. So the phase to find the phase constant we are going to use this tan phi okay trigonometric ratio is equal to something okay from this what we can get is we can actually find the value of phi and we know that the tan is equal to how much p by b isn't it perpendicular divided by base so therefore this will be equal to how much then this is tan of phi will be equal to what is perpendicular it is simple v l minus of v c divided by and what is base base is my v r so this whole length is my base which is v r so this let me write equation number one for the tan of phi from there we get the value of phase constant okay so uh, let us uh, solve this for some more uh, to some more good equations and we know that what is v l okay what is v l again we will we'll do this one v is equal to i r isn't it we have already done this but i am also doing it here so v r will be how much i into r and how much be v of l because i want this will be i into x l what is v c this will be i into x of c we have done this in the previous lesson okay i is the current r is the resistance v l is the potential drop in this one so i is the current because current is same in series and xl is the resistance offered by this inductor which is called inductive reactance xc is the resistance offered by capacitor known as in uh, capacitive uh, in capacitive reactance so let me put these values here if i put then this can be written as tan phi equals i xl minus i xc whole divided by i into of r okay then what i get i will get i take this common i will be taken as common xl minus of xc divided by i into r is there fine this is again tan phi right and this current i and this current i will cancel then what do i get i get this equation okay i i cancels everything has got cancelled and i got what xl minus xc divided by r so this is my equation number two so this is how we can find the uh, tan phi that is the phase constant okay so what will be the phase constant then then this phi will be equal to tan inverse of this one isn't it xl minus xc divided by r this is how we can solve so let me go to some more interesting uh, phenomenon here this entire lcr circuit will sometime it will uh, act like what it will act like a pure capacitive circuit and sometime it will act like a pure inductive circuit what does this mean it means that sometime it will act as if there is only inductor though resistance and capacitor are also there sometime this will act like as if there is only capacitor by capacitive reactance by capacitive circuit okay as if there is only capacitor now let us find what are the conditions okay these are very important point as for the the board examinations okay so uh, what we have find so far tan of phi is equal to xl okay so let me write here this is xl minus of x divided by r isn't it we have find this one okay so first one is inductive 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 circuit inductive circuit means this entire series lcr circuit behave like as if there is only inductor and when it will happen okay it will happen we know that when in inductor what is happening in inductor the voltage is leading and the current is lagging so when it will happen let me write when v leads the 
current I and then we can say this is purely inductive. Now when this will happen, this will happen when this tan of phi okay, is greater than 0 or, or when tan phi is positive. Okay, when tan phi is greater than 0, if you calculate this value tan phi, if I calculate this value, if it is greater than 0 or if it is greater than 0 means it is positive, then that time the voltage will lead. Now it means that if there is leading of voltage and lagging of current, then this circuit will be inductive circuit. Now when this tan phi will become greater than 0, when this will become positive? It will become positive when when xl that is when xl is greater xl is greater than xc isn't it positive minus negative so this is always positive okay if this is greater than this one this entire term will become positive positive means greater than zero then this circuit will behave like an inductive circuit so next circuit is my capacitive capacitive circuit okay we are uh, finding inductive circuit and capacitive circuit only from the series lcr right please understand this so that is when when it will become capacitive when the current leads when the voltage lags or isn't it if the voltage lags and the current leads from this diagram there will there will be a capacitive so i will write when when v lags the current okay it is actually happening in the capacitor we have studied isn't it so if there is lagging of voltage and leading of current then that will be the capacitive circuit then when it will become it will become it will become it when this tan of phi is less than zero or tan phi is negative okay when the tan phi is this value is less than zero that is negative then this circuit will behave like capacitive circuit as if there is only capacitor because at that situation if the tan phi is less than zero that time the voltage will lag the current right so when it will happen when it will become negative if this value is large okay this is minus xc if this is large then this then this will become negative isn't it it is like xl minus of xc if xl is 2 if xc is 5 then what will become this will be negative isn't it this value will become negative then it means that that is it will happen when xl is less than xc or simply or xc is greater than xl both are same in fact okay xl is less than xc अगर ये लेस हो गया तो ये ज्यादा होगा ये ज्यादा तो नेगेटिव इट इज डन नाउ देयर इज वन मोर थिंग व्हिच आई शुड ऑलवेज टेल यू दैट इज रेजोनेंट रेजोनेंट सर्किट व्हेन दिस विल बिकम रेजोनेंट सर्किट इट विल बिकम रेजोनेंट सर्किट दैट इज व्हेन करंट एंड वोल्टेज हैव नो फेज डिफरेंस फेज difference that is like this in this situation current and voltage are not having any phase difference unlike this and this so when there is no phase difference between current and the voltage in series lcr circuit that time this will be known as resonant circuit or resistive circuit it can be also known as resistive circuit and it, and when it will become it will become when when tan of phi is equal to 0 it is nor less than nor greater than 0 nor less than 0 and it will happen when it will happen when this will be equal to 0 when this will be equal to 0 resistance cannot be 0 isn't it resistance of this resistance cannot be 0 but when this entire term will become 0 if this is equal to this if xl is equal to xc here then this minus this will become 0 then entire tan phi will be equal to 0 that is when xc is equal to xl that time there is no phase difference 
in this situation we call this as resonant circuit or purely resistive circuit now uh, in the next lesson we are going to study about the resonance in this circuit what is the meaning of resonance in fact in all the radios in the old old radios these days we don't have radio we have everything in the mobile phone and all these radios used this kind of circuit cds lcr to catch that signal it will only catch that signal when there is resonance okay resonance uh, you must have done one experiment in class 11 also okay uh, by tuning fork and getting the paper slip down from the sonometer all these are in uh, resonance even whenever there is earthquake all the houses will not fall down which will not fall down only uh, some uh, some of the houses will fall down some of the buildings will fall down why because of the resonance okay that we will talk in the next lesson so next topic will be the resonance in series LCR and this series LCR is also called tuning circuit because we tune it to get the frequency of radio frequency to listen music etc etc that used to be happen in the very uh, past uh, few decades okay for today thank you wait 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 the SI unit of this 10 phi is nothing it do not have any SI unit okay the phase constant will not have any uh, SI unit because this XL and XC are resistance which has the SI unit ohm and this resistance is also having the unit ohm and ohm divided by ohm is nothing so 10 phi which is phase constant is a unitless quantity finally thank you